Hello, welcome to another week of ranking some Disney characters. Uh, if you're joining me from the podcast with Dink, welcome. Welcome. Uh, why did you sound like that? <laughs> I was just welcoming our guests. You, you sounded like you were 12 octaves lower than your normal voice. Welcome. I hate it. Um, <laughs> This is my dumb partner, Juicy, and we're going to be going through... Uh, some well, some interesting movies I think today. First, obviously we got Hercules, Hercules, which I think is gonna a be of, a lot of lot of big players, a lot of top movie. tier characters in that one. Yeah, for sure. Um, so honestly, let's start with Hercules, and you know I'm gonna put it number one. Hercules, always my favorite. It's a good one. Hercules is the best. Yeah. Um, the music, the characters. Um, the fact that it's hilarious. The fact that it's basically just Superman. Yeah. It's literally the story of Superman. He gets adopted by farmers. He, um, I never even thought of that. Yeah, he gets adopted by farmers. Um, then he goes. He he finds a place to train. Um, basically, he meets his dad, a stone version of his dad, which isn't his real dad. Like kind of like Superman meets Jarrell. And then he goes to a major city to fight crime. But yeah, I think I think Hercules is an easy number one for me. I, I've probably watched Hercules four times in the last year. Yeah, I don't know if it's like number one for me. It might be. It's definitely like top three though, I would think. Yeah. I I I'm putting it one. I, I think honestly, Hercules, Aladdin, Lion King, any given day they could switch. Yeah. Um, so starting with some Hercules characters. Um mm-hmm. Let's go with good old Hades. So, uh, Hades can control fire. He's a literal god. Um, oh, he's such a god. He can. His size changes. Uh, he's immortal. He. Uh, he's super strong. I really have no idea where to put him. <laughs> I well, like. I think we start with the fact that he's immortal. Yeah. I mean, but. Going on that, can't you've... Be defeated. well, so we're putting this as a maybe not necessarily a fight to the death, but a fight to knockout. I see. But just because there's so many characters in the Disney universe that technically can't die. Yeah. Because uh, uh, we uh, will be dealing with two other immortals. <laughs> yeah. Um, but I mean, as far as him, I, I, I don't. <sighs> I don't think he beats Genie. I, I just because he might be like two or three though. Yeah, honestly, I'm I'm inclined to put him on par with almost the same skill set as Chernabog because basically Chernabog is absolute darkness and mm-hmm. absolute evil, which Hades kind of is as well. Um, does he not beat um the wizard guy at two? That's see. That's where I'm. I I think I am right now. Does he or does he not? Um, I guess Who, he. What's his? Who's that too? That's Merlin. It's Merlin. Yeah. Um. I could, you know, I could see him beating him because once again, the main reason that we have him so high up is because of the virus thing, and I don't think that takes out Hades. Yeah, I think he's at two. To be honest with you. Yeah, I just think Genie, like, the fact that he's cosmic power. <laughs> It's all about getting that. Uh, it's all about getting that genie aligned matchup <laughs> first round. Yeah, I hope that doesn't happen. That'd be so disappointing. <laughs> <laughs> all right, uh, so I think that's a. I think that's a fine place for him. Honestly, should we just do Zeus while we're talking gods? I get, and uh, I think you might as well have cleared out of space because if Hades is two, Zeus is one, uh, two. You th- yeah, Z- you think Zeus goes above Hades? I think so. Yeah. The one thing I will say I think um, Hades has above Zeus is I think he's a little more clever and well-planned than Zeus is. Yeah, man. Lightning bolt. That is true. But, I mean, Hades does capture Zeus at one point. I mean, he with the help of the Titans, but he does he does defeat Zeus. Um, I think I, I personally am still inclined to put Zeus him. above him. 
Yeah, I am too. I think Zeus still goes above Hades because I, once again, with the Titans, like you can't really use them to judge Hades because they are their own things, kind of. Yeah. He also, um, Zeus can take over giant statues and be a giant, be small. Uh, he has control of thunder. Yeah. And it's like, I think they're both basically just on par with power. <laughs> it really is just going to be a matter of who can get the upper hand. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then we got the Hercules. Probably putting him too. Um, so the thing with Hercules, it comes down to like, again, how do we want to rate Hercules, um, how he is throughout the movie or how he is at the end of the movie? Cause at the end of the movie, that's when he becomes immortal. Otherwise throughout the entire movie, he's basically mortal. I mean, even at the end of the movie, it doesn't necessarily, I mean, he doesn't die and he gets that gold ring around him, which I think is supposed to symbolize he's mortal or he's immortal. Um, yeah. But, like, really the whole thing was, the, was at the beginning of the movie, pain and panic made him suck on that potion. He, and because he didn't finish the last drop, he still had a drop of immortality. Yeah. Um. And unlike Zeus and Hades, he doesn't have an extra power. Like, he's just, he's super strong. Um, He can leap tall buildings in a single bound. Uh, he's faster than a speeding bull. Oh, shit, I'm getting my characters mixed up. <laughs> um, he's tough then. Um, yeah, I... I think maybe three, to be honest. Yeah, he did beat Hades in, like, a, a punching. <laughs> like, he did... Yeah. Yeah. Who plays Hades? Who's um, that voice actor? James Woods. Oh, okay. Great voice. <laughs> God, you have me wanting to watch that movie now. It's oh, good movie. do it. I could watch it again. <laughs> we should have watched it together. Meg, where do you want to put her in the bench? I don't... Yeah. Um. No, I think, honestly, with Meg, I could make a case for this area. Oh. Um... Um, she doesn't, honestly, she unfortunately doesn't do much in the movie other than be a little know. bit I, sassy. I mean, like, she did hold I her own she... against the centaur. Yeah, I think she's, she's like tough and feisty, but like, she doesn't really do much to be honest. Like, she, you know, she's just like your classic Disney princess, like not really doing much. So I'm, <laughs> honestly, I think like. Uh, definitely not above, like, Pinchito, but, you know, I think kind of, to be honest, just bench. Yeah? You think the dogs beat her? Yeah, I think... Mm. I just, like, I feel like... I'd probably put her at 58. Yeah, see, that's the case. Oh, who's at 58? I'm, oh, I got fucked up it's here. It's the hummingbird. Yeah, I, like, I just don't... I You said, what, 58? Eight, yeah. Yeah. I, like, can't really make a case for her to be on the bench just because I, I don't think the dogs can beat her. She, I mean, yeah. like I said, she held her own against the centaur. She made a deal with Hades. I could see her being scrappy. She's clever. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Yeah. I, she is a hard character of the rank because, like I said, she doesn't do much. <laughs> yeah, exactly. All right. Now my boy Pegasus got tier um <laughs> um i mean i don't know i don't think he's top 10 yo absolutely not top 10 he again he, he also doesn't do much um he gets captured cool character but you know doesn't do too much he flies he's flying yeah. horse, like that's really all he um, he does get captured by pain and panic but then later on he literally stomps the shit out of them <laughs> literally yeah um I would, for Pegasus, I could honestly make a case for, um... I'm thinking between, like... Thir anywhere between 39 and 42, I think. Yeah. Um, I'm kind of inclined to put him at 39 above Scar. But also Scar... Honestly, I, I just can't tell if Scar, Khan, and Raja can just rip, rip him apart. They're all very similar. I think they could, to be honest with you. 
I'm probably putting him 42. 42. Yeah, I don't. I think he could hold his own against Rafiki. Yeah. I yeah. I definitely could see him holding his own against Rafiki. 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 Yeah. I'll yeah. put pain and panic even lower than that. Uh, the thing with pain and panic. Um. Actually. Yeah. Let's do them next because we're gonna get into them. So for pain and panic, I it's like. They break a. They were able to break into Mount Olympus, Olympus, which is a feat. Um, they also got their asses handed to them by a baby Hercules, though. However, they yeah, no, I, I mean they're kind of just goofballs. Um... Yeah, but they also are demons, and they can take pain and panic. Yeah. Um... <laughs> They fall downstairs at one point. Um, Hades lights them on fire multiple times. They're basically push push pins. Push, yeah. uh, cushions. I mean, the thing is, like Pegasus did, like kind of beat them. Yeah, but they were in they were in snake form. I should have mentioned that they were a snake. So oh, they were. Yeah. Snakes. Yeah. Um. I could. I would make a case for them to be on a similar par. As Tweedledee and Tweedledum. I was just thinking that. I was like, they're very similar, I uh-huh. think, to Tweedledee and Tweedledum. I um, think I could honestly put them 35 above Tweedledee and Tweedledum. I, I could do that, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I just... They're very similar to me. They're they're both, like, honestly, Tweedledee and Tweedledum are also, like, cushions. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, what? No, we're taking Pooh off the list! Oh. Get out of here. I didn't even realize we were at Pooh. Oh, R.I.P. Pooh, Pooh, you might come back when I watch the new Winnie the Pooh movie. You still have a chance, Pooh. His run isn't over yet, but probably is. Pooh, I'm, I'm, I'm that's the first one I'm like kind of sad to see off the list. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and then Danny DeVito's left. Oh uh, yeah, Danny De. Well, uh, yeah, Danny DeVito is last. Um, I could honestly, so here's the weird thing about Phil. He trained Hercules, Achilles, Theseus, Odysseus. Um, but he doesn't like, they don't show him do anything. And he's like, just kind of an old beaten up Danny DeVito. Go. Yeah. Um, so I honestly could make a case for him for bench. Yeah. I was thinking bench. Yeah. It's just like. It's weird because how does someone like that train those people and be bench? But well, I just don't think he's like a fighter naturally. He's a trainer. Yeah. I mean, there's a lot of trainers who can train, but they're not good at what they're training at. That's fair. Uh yeah. So that's uh, that's it for Hercules. It was honestly a lot of strong characters coming out of Hercules. As tough as I thought it would be. 